You all, Bobby Raiden here, I'm afraid the codes that I used to get the Legacy Video Maker and Comedy World back on Vion Studio had got patched. But I found a new way to get it back, and do you know what this means? Comedy World is not over yet, and I will show you a new way on how to get it back, along with the Legacy Video Maker, yay. So the first thing you want to do is that you want to open up Google Chrome, the old one if you have Flash, I will leave the link to the download of the old Google in the description. The next thing you want to do is that you want to go to beyond.com, and log into your Google account with it, you see this Heroku app website for the legacy video maker, the link is https colon slash slash beyond2018.herokuapp.com slash video maker, I will leave the link in the description for it. The next thing you want to do is to copy the link. After you've copied the Heroku app code, go to beyond.com, and click the three dots, go to more tools, click developer tools. Oops, I messed up. I meant right click the try it free button. Now replace the https colon slash slash app dot dot com slash v2 slash sign up link with the http colon slash slash vion 2018 dot terroq app dot com slash video maker link and it will take you right to the legacy video maker instead of vion studio. And bam, you got the legacy video maker back on vion. Now for Comedy World, but when you click any theme on this Heroku app website, it won't show the actual maker, so if you have wrapper offline, I suggest using 1.2.5 for it. I will leave the link for the wrapper offline in the description. So now for the old themes, open your wrapper offline folder, and click start wrapper.bat and keep it open, but don't edit any videos, so when you're on Google Chrome. Go to localhost 4343 and copy the http colon slash slash localhost colon 4343 slash go underscore 4. Tray equals custom link, then go back to the legacy video maker and click the whiteboard animation select button and click inspect and then replace the slash video maker slash full slash question mark tray equals custom link with the http colon slash slash localhost colon 4343 slash go underscore 4. Tray equals custom link and when you click the select button on the whiteboard animation it will take you to the wrapper offline, and no this is not fake it's 100% real and don't use request because those got patched. And voila, it worked.